Yasmin's actually driving for once. <laughs> um, we are just at Tesco's, well just on our way into Tesco's because we're going to get some ingredients because we're going to do a cooking video for you. Um, we're going to meet my mum in here and hopefully sneak some more bits in the shopping basket. <laughs> So we're just in Tesco's and there's a sign saying due to recent poor weather conditions we are expecting some availability issues on bananas. So if you're in Tesco's, sorry, no sauce. So we're still in Tesco, but we're also in Costa. <laughs> Yasmin's just got really excited about the Maserati in, oh, Polo, Maserati in Tesco cars, but car park. Look at it. We have now got to go to Sainsbury's um, because one thing had completely sold out in Tesco's which is the lemongrass so we're now on a supermarket hunt for some lemongrass. So we're going to be showing you how to make this which is the Thai fish cakes. We've got all of our ingredients out in little bowls and we're going to show you how to make it. We're also going to make, where is it? Where are you? Ah oh, this one. Pork pad thai without the pork. Without the pork, so we're just going to have pad thai noodles and thai fish cakes. The basis for the fish cakes is we've got 500 grams of cod, which is fillet seared, it's got no bones and no skin on it. We've got a um, handful of chopped coriander, we've got two chilies, but for the fish cakes we're only going to use half of this. We've got um, spring onions, we're going to use half of that lemongrass and we're also going to use the zest from two limes and we're going to keep these to put on the fish cakes after and we're just going to chuck all that in a food processor to make our mix and you just want to do this until the mixture is fairly smooth so this is our mixture and I'm just going to use a serving spoon just to um, portion these out and then I'm putting it on a oiled baking tray just to, I'm going to use my hands just to mould them into our little fish cake parcels. <laughs> so once you've um, portioned your fish cakes we managed to get um, eight out of our mix and we're just going to put some fire light which is like a low calorie spray all over it. And then we're going to pop them in the oven on 180 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. And after about 7 to 10 minutes, you want to flip them over so they get cooked evenly on both sides. Okay, so for the pad thai, we've used some fry light spray, two tablespoons of dark soy sauce and one teaspoon of fish sauce which are both there. Next we're going to add in the next lot of ingredients. So we're going to use the rest of the chilli. Then we're going to add in spring onions and we're going to add in the ginger and the garlic. And we're just going to leave this on a low heat for five minutes. Oh we forgot. Five tablespoons of vegetable stock as well. Okay, so the next lot you need to add is a pak choy, and we've actually just added some baby corn in there as well as an additional ingredient. So just put that all in. Then we'll be adding some sliced carrots, and then we'll be adding 250 grams of green sprouts. And then once this is all gone into the wok, you just want to turn your oven up to high for another five minutes and let that all cook. We're going to add the rice noodles into the wok. And just spread around with the rest of the ingredients. And the last ingredient to add is an egg. And 
they're finished. <laughs> I was off sick yesterday, I'm going out tomorrow. We are now at Chelsea at a beer festival at Cake Store and I'm drinking some dodgy cider at the beer festival. There's hardly anything left, it's a Saturday night and my food came on Thursday, midweek. Morning guys, um, we're just stopping off at McDonald's and um, we're just actually on our way to get our nails done we've been a little bit naughty but we're still going to go for a run later. How's last night? Very nice, we're quite chilled to yeah. the end. Yeah. I got in and fell, fell asleep, fell yeah. asleep we went to, um, where did we go first? Uh, the beer festival. Yeah, we went to beer festival, uh, tried a few beers and me and Sophie don't really like beer. That was beer. actually quite nice. Yeah, coconut beer is a good one. And um, yeah, we ended up in the shisha bar until about half one. Yeah, Which nice. was really nice. We got some food there, we got some, what did we have? A gummy bear one and... Oh uh, yeah, gummy bear and uh, something. Easy peach. Yeah, easy peach, which somehow tasted a bit like cherry, but yeah, it's really nice. So if you ever fancy having a shisha, you should go there. So we're just heading into South End. We've both just had our nails done. Ooh. I got like an orangey, pinky, and you got a it's like grey, purple. Grey, purple. Really nice. Um, yeah, so really happy with our nails, and I think we're going to try and have a little look around town. Okay, so we've just been to Henry Burgers. It was our first experience and it was very, very nice. And um, we're just going to take a little walk along the seafront and take you guys with us. Anyone who knows me knows I have loads of notebooks. I don't intend to write in all of them. But um, there's loads here in TK Maxx and they're just great. <laughs> this one's really sweet. It says, Love is beautiful. And there's little ones with little sayings on and some really cute, like leathery ones. And Yaz has walked off because she thinks I'm crazy. Chloe, if you're watching this, notebook galore. <laughs> So we attempted to uh, walk down the seafront. So windy. It was so windy, and uh, we literally got like halfway. We were like, no, no, let's go back. Um, I got some sweets in uh, what's it called, Mr. Sims. Mr. Sims, um, some like old-fashioned sweets in a bag, and then Sophie bought some stuff from Tico Max. I'll show you when we get home. <laughs> we were in there for about an hour. Yeah, just There's literally so browsing stuff. at like bags, the makeup, the skincare. There was so much stuff. Yeah. There. Um, but yeah, we just got a little bit carried away. <laughs> I was in there for like ages. Yeah, and now it's raining and we're stuck in traffic on the way home. <laughs> we haven't got to go for a run in this yet. Oh, baby, I love you way. Every day. So we didn't end up going for a run, um, it's terribly cold and raining and I know that sounds like such a lame excuse but 
we could have got potentially quite ill yeah. and it's Sunday night and I was like so we came really home and had <laughs> this weather. So we came home and had tea instead. <laughs> yeah, Sophie's just doing a blog post on Henry Burgers that we went to. Um, this should be up pretty soon. Uh, we are just going to end the vlog here. Yep. And we'll see you in our next video. See you soon. Bye. Bye.